all love to celebrate Independence Day with some fireworks, right? But the recent dry spell and the fire risk has forced several North Texas counties to put a burn ban in place. As Kennedy Walker reports, they also are ready to hand out some hefty fines for anyone who decides to put on their own show. Devin Fanzler will not be popping fireworks this 4th of July. I would hate to say that we wanted to go out and pop some fireworks and I killed my neighbor by accident because so I burned their house down, so it, it wouldn't be worth it for me. He lives in one of four counties that's under a disaster declaration. The lack of rain has led to severe drought conditions. It's a really tough time. Fireworks are banned in Parker, Johnson, Navarro, and Paulo Pinto. You can still buy them at local stands, but the penalty of shooting fireworks in restricted areas is steep ranging from $500 to $1,000. Parker County is filled with tons of areas like this that are covered in grass. And as you can see, the weather has caused the grass and the ground to be so dry that it wouldn't take much for a fire to ignite. Jonathan Henderson says dry weather is something he takes seriously. I've known a lot of people have lost their homes with fires, so I think it's really important to mitigate that. Both men say while not popping fireworks is a bummer, it's worth it if it means everyone remains safe. It's fun to look at and it's cool and all that, but it's not worth life. The Texas A&M Forest Service is reporting about 75% of our state is under a burn ban, but fireworks are still allowed in unincorporated areas. In Parker County, Kennedy Walker, CBS 11 News.